Hi, everybody. It is Saturday, May 14th. Russ Mitchell from the CBS News Broadcast Center in New York. The great Sally Rosen back behind the camera. Sally, welcome back. Good to have you here today. We're going to go live tonight to Louisiana, where officials are opening up the floodgates in the swollen Mississippi River. Now, these officials say it is necessary, but not everybody is happy about it, especially the farmers. Our Dean Reynolds is in Louisiana. He'll have a live report for us on the latest. Also, the Republican presidential field is shaping up. And tonight, Mike Huckabee is expected to make an announcement. We don't know which way he's going to go, if he's going to be in the race or not. Obviously, it's a big deal. Our John Dickerson is going to be here to handicap the Republican field and tell us what's happening now and down the road. And today is a very important day in American history. On this day, 50 years ago, a group of freedom riders, a group of college students who headed south to try to change segregation laws, their bus was burned right outside of Birmingham, Alabama, and these freedom riders, these, these college kids, were almost burned alive. Well, that led to more freedom rides, and eventually the nation was changed. I spoke with one of the freedom riders. We'll get his incredible story and much more tonight at the CBS Evening News. It's all coming up in just a bit. See you soon.